Well, now we know that he hasn't softened at all, and he's doubled down on all of his anti-immigration positions. He wants to massively increase immigration enforcement at the border and on the inside of the United States. He wants to deport virtually all illegal immigrants, and he wants to slash legal immigration. Well, I think that for folks who might have been expecting a softening, what they saw actually was not just a double down, but perhaps a tripling down, right? So you ended up the night with mass deportation, massive escalation of enforcement, even though it's already at record high levels and migration from Mexico is at net zero, and actually opposition to legal immigration. I don't think that there's any room for doubt or for interpretation if you understand how the immigration system works. There is no line for folks who are currently here without status to get in back of. So the notion that they have to leave and get in a line that doesn't exist basically means what Trump's campaign people had been saying. There is no change. He's only going to use different words. His position paper on immigration outlines in detail how he wants to remove all criminals who are illegal immigrants or immigrants in the United States. But when he lists all the other categories of people that he wants to remove, those who overstay visas, those who cross the borders illegally, that accounts for virtually all illegal immigrants by themselves. Interestingly, at the end of that speech, he said, after we do all these policies and we'll see who's left and maybe we'll talk about a way to address that problem, is an admission that his harsh deportation policies might not work. 